From Debbie One, why did you come out and decide to speak up against all of the SJW knowing the potential backlash? I know it's not that much of a ground shattering thing to come out against SJWs these days because, I mean, it's kind of in vogue as well. It's, or the tides are turning that way, but I don't know. I just got so sick of it. I couldn't care less about your political affiliation. I just, what I care about is facts, reason, and evidence. So if you come at me and you say something that's baseless, that's what pisses me off. I mean, there's, so I'm just, I'm coming out for reason. <laughs> Bring reason back. Make reason sexy again. Make evidence sexy again. That's, that's my philosophy. Like, because if we're not, if we're not arguing with facts, we're arguing with feelings. And Feelings did a little thing called World War II and won and all the rest of the wars. McSlats12345 Recently you've been revealing more of your political ideologies. Could you ever see yourself making more serious content on these matters? This is such a weird question because normally I, I, I'm not, I, I never wanted to bring politics into my career. It's just not something I think you should publicly talk about really. Or, but th the rules have just been broken. Every goddamn celebrity is just fascism and ism and real in America 2017, literally shaking all the time. So I was just like, oh, fine, you're pulling me into it, fine. So I just wanted to give a voice of reason. I, I don't know if I have. I've probably just made things worse. But uh, no, I don't really plan to continue it. If, you know, if some day comes where it, it's appropriate, fine. I I'll be like Bill Maher or something, but I, it's not really what I envision myself doing. If, it, if there isn't honest to God demand for it, maybe someday. But I don't know, I have a feeling they would just look up my old videos and go, is this guy really qualified to give political opinions? <laughs> I don't think this guy's got the resume.